Hello, welcome back to Isla Glades. Thanks for joining me once again as we continue to work on our downtown area. So today I think I'd like to work in this area here on this mound with the European style building. And I'd like to build something similar to this structure here. Make it more square. So I think it's gonna be roughly 18 by 20. And I wanna put it on a hill so that when you drive in here, you come up the road you meet the building and have to go around the building and then come back down. We'll see how much space we have up here as we kind of build it. I think we can pull it off and it'll look pretty nice. I guess we'll, we'll have to kind of figure out the orientation. This is it's a curve here, so maybe we'll put it like right about here. Let's get started. And I got my, my, my good co-pilots, JJ Trouble Twitch and Jororia in the house, lighting up the chat on Twitch. So if you want to see me live, of course, Take my take my YouTube name, smash it all together, New Build City. And come say hi, and then you can be part of the the gang gang here. <laughs> they all say hi. So I think I like this height here that this mound is on. Let's see here. Let's get out the level tool because I, what I like to do, I think this is good height, and then I think I want to raise it up another. We'll say maybe. See, we're gonna lose some space here, so maybe let's try five units of height. One, two, three, four, five. Like roughly about there. Let's just see how much higher that is. We'll, we'll go ahead and flatten this whole thing out. Maybe we'll t start taking away the land too. We'll start taking, eating away in, in here. As we go. But maybe this guy will be on a hill. The... the, <laughs> the Zoria says the blink the blimp gang is around. They, they they've been they've been dying to get blimp in this city, I tell you what. It goes against all my religious beliefs to have blimps in this city. <laughs> Strip if you have a problem. There you go. Alright, so let's start with the dirt road here. Right here. And we have our guides on. Yep, that's good. Oh, we're saving. So this road's going to kind of come up here like this. So we're probably going to be something. Let's just draw a road here. Maybe from here up. Let's see how we'll start it straight. Kind of give it a little, little the old freeform try here. And kind of want it to kind of do like this kind of motion. That's kind of the general idea, but it's a little bit to the left. Okay, so but now I got at least I kind of got the curve or the angle. So we want something if we're gonna do something straight, maybe something like this. I'm just gonna draw it out right here. And that looks about the angle I think we're gonna need. I'm like doing the hypotenuse, not the hypotenuse, we're doing a tangent line to the curve. For those of you who are, are in the math. That's about right, actually. I think that's going to be pretty good. Let me get rid of this. And then we, of course, we'll, we'll, we'll curve the roads around as we need to. <laughs> so the next step, let's go ahead and it's, I feel like that's about the middle. I mean, we can try and find the middle by just taking a road. Or, road maybe right about here and just measure it out and we're saying it's we'll say 1600 so what's 16 divided by 2 is 8 right so we're pretty much right in the middle so it would actually be right about here and that should be about the middle here well we can just double check if we go from here to here it's about 800 900 bucks Yep, about 900, 900 bucks. That's about right. All right, I guess we can check from here to here. So we'll say is roughly the middle is eight hundred bucks. So we'll say nine hundred, something like here. That's like one more tick. Look at about here. 
That should get the building pretty center. All right, that's good. And then we need to go out, we're doing what? We're doing a square, that's gonna be, I wanna say it's 20 units by 18 units. So 440 needs to be this length. All right, so we need to do this. Where's the middle again? Right here. All right, so it's 220, so this needs to be 200. Another 200. Two twenty. This should do the trick. Two twenty. All right. Now do we get it right? Two, four, six, eight. Oh shit! Let's get this. Let's get them. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen. All right, listen good. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty. Looking good. Is this the middle? We'll put a path here. And then I'll know when I go to zone it, and that's what where the path goes. Could you check your Discord DMs for me, please? I can. I can. Discord. I haven't been on Discord in like a week. But yeah, I can do that. Well, let's put this path in for now. Uh, we need to do this. At the middle. Good. I'll show you to at Zororia. Oh, okay. Sounds like a plan. All right, that's our first building. When you first come in. So I think I want to lower the, the height. So let's do that. We're going to bring it down. One, two, three. Yeah, about there. Bring the height back down to where it was. We have our little building on a hill here. And we'll go ahead and... and kind of blend that out. So I'm envisioning the buildings getting smaller but more numerous as we get away from this thing. Is that is a high enough hill? It's set ready for you when you are. All right. Uh, I don't think I have Discord. I have Discord on my phone. I can check it in here in a minute. Let's go ahead and get this piece knocked out real quick. There we go. All right. All right. So the next piece. This road is going to come up here to here. Actually, I think I want a little bit more height. So we'll drop off maybe as much but you give a little bit more of a hill all right so what I'm envisioning next is something like this and as you're driving up, maybe we'll start the road back here. 
You cut. You come up to this piece here. And as you, on the next, so the next thing you'll see are these buildings. So these will, this will be on the side. So this is a six by six. So now we got to look at where are the roads going to come in. Maybe the road should come in from here. It's a little bit more straight on. And then we'll have to do it so, because we got to keep some of this. Like these roads got to be straight to build these things. So let's see. We got to figure that out. So we'll say a road comes down here. We'll just draw it out like five units for now. Or four units. Like that. So, but we need to kind of come this way. Make like a turn. So what we could do is something like this. Maybe we'll do a 45 here. So if we come out of one full road length, one full road length, and come back to that node, we'll get us this nice 45. Does it see where that, does that point us to? It points us here. It's a little off. Hmm, so we need an angle that's not quite 45. So to do that, if we do it longer here, like one and a half by half, Come here. Nah, it's not straight. Do like one. I say not quite right either. I might just have to freehand it. Maybe we'll draw it like this. Have it come out like this angle. So this is what's straight here, right? Maybe at the here. I know. You don't like the nodes there, buddy. 320, I think, was the number. Yeah, it's flat. It looks flatter. Oh, oh. gotta be careful. We got all the road guides now. These dimensions have to be right. Also, it's not going to work. All right. So as you come up, you see that. So maybe we have another little turn. To stuff with all these turns. Is there a better way to do it without having all, as many turns or keeping it a little tighter? Yeah, maybe not. Maybe we'll go ahead and do the same thing on this side. Have it come like out here. I think, I think the angle I had was about 170. I should have took note. I'm ahead for... Alright, take care, JJ. You be good. Are you sticking around too, uh, Zora? Or are you heading out as well? I want to bring this out. What I, I forgot what I brought it out to last time. I should have freaking checked. 280. Something like that is good. Hit it right here. 320. What's Bimp Flip Gang? <laughs> What's the Flip Gang? Ah, these crazy guys. You know how they are with their blips. Everyone's got to have a blimp these days. 
All right, this is six by six. That looks about right. So we can probably, if we run this other road first, we'll be, we'll be good shape. So push that like that. And then we just need to run like a road so that this, who cares what this is? I guess I don't really care. Three is probably fine. That's gonna be trees. And then now hopefully we can come out here. I mean, now we need this to be four. And it should, it's four or four. All right, so that looks good. And do the same thing over here. Grab this guy, just push it all the way up. Then we can smooth it out later. Do the same thing with the road. Right here, just run it like this. It's a little bit of a hilly road, that's okay. They'll survive. I think they'll survive on pigeon. All right, so that's good. So that'll be this tier. And then we'll lower the lane a little bit more. We like the next tier. We'll just knock it down like, uh, I don't know, like three, it's at one, two, three, four units. So let's pop it, maybe one more. A little bit more height difference. Let's bring this around, kind of bring it like this. At least we have a little bit of a hill effect here. Kind of like this. Maybe even we'll bring it down a little bit more. It feels like it's not that low. Kind of like that. Kinda like that. Uh, go. Got to go to, up in the morning. All right, Peter, take care. I'm off tomorrow. So I might be streaming a little bit later, which would be probably dinner time for you guys out, out there on the east, across the pond, as they say. All right. Let's grab, I think I'll grab one more level. Let's see about where we are. Drop a follow, bro. Have a good, good one, Peter. Thanks. All right. Yeah, more streams. <laughs> yeah, I might. We'll see. Uh, it doesn't seem that much higher. So I feel like we can probably even go a little bit, a little bit more dramatic here. Get a little bit more of a hill. This peel. I feel like I feel like this is an onion. We just keep peeling it back. That's what. That's probably good. Keep peeling the onion back. Gonna get flooding later. Right, that's good. That looks good. So the next level will be another straight road. Blimps are. Like onions, they have <laughs> they have layers. Um, sometimes they make you cry. Both blimps and onions. And they will have this come out like four units. We'll have it. We'll start the road here. That way, it shouldn't pop the land up. And we need to go out. Uh, not 280. 280. There we go. We can do two coming out the middle. Oh, we'll just do 280 here. 280. Should be a 5x5. Five five. And it is. We'll do the same thing here. Push it all the way up. We're close to. Like that. And then we'll come right here. About here, right? Right here. 280. 280. 280. 280. There we go. Yeah. We got three blocks in between. Blocks in between. That's good. 
Let's make me cry because they're so majestic. <laughs> so majestic. Yeah. Yeah. I think so. I think so. We should have made this a four lane road. Uh -uh, whatever. And we could probably make this a curve. Maybe not. I'm gonna line it with trees. It's good. Maybe we'll put retaining walls in. That might be nice to put a little retaining wall in. That's gonna be a that's gonna be a challenge. Yeah, I like challenging myself though. That's gonna do it. But I didn't. Are we gonna leave another gap? Put some trees. Get a flat. So there's this is eight, nine, ten. That'll work. So let's just double check this. So there's a corner piece, then another two. Well, we just do this. It's easier just to do this. So where's my zoning? So this is the corner piece here. Then we're gonna have a four by four. Four by four. Four by four. 4x4 four four leads us to. And we'll have a 2x2 two two and a 2x2, two two, and then we'll have the two paths. Okay, this is it. That's it. That's right to mention. I got like a little service center in, in here. So it's got a, a little power plant and trash, a death care, taxi, maintenance buildings for the roads, as well as the parks. Kind of this like, got a little like nice little windy road that kind of comes through here. As well as I got our services in for this area here. So we got like our police, fire, and um, health, as well as the postal service. We got a little bit of death care and daycare, you know, child care in here. So it's going to be a pretty good sized neighborhood. So it's, it's probably suitable to have that in there. And then I just kind of was tinkering around with this kind of like school area where we got you know, the courts and the, the high school, I mean, two elementary schools. I might move one of them. I'm not sure because I might end up putting the metro somewhere in here. So maybe what we'll do is move like one over here somewhere, and then in that spot we'll put the metro uh, line, and then we'll bring, then we'll have maybe bus or tram kind of collecting folks in this area and bring them to the metro to kind of either get down into this station here to kind of go wherever they want to go, or we'll have that metro kind of come up to here, and maybe we'll do, uh, you know, like the 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 one that's got like the four tracks, the four platforms instead of the two. It's a sunken one there, so. Um, what I'll do is I'll start zoning, and then I'll bring it back as it's kind of coming in, and kind of give you a walkthrough of what's going on. See you, see you shortly. Hello, and welcome back. Thanks for joining me once again. So this neighborhood is finished up real nicely. Most of it's zoned in. I think it looks pretty good. It came, like I said, it came in pretty nice. It's boosted our population quite a bit. I was surprised. We're almost at we're at forty-two thousand three hundred people. We started at like thirty-five, so it almost gave us ten thousand just that neighborhood. Uh, which is pretty amazing, really. The European area has come to life. You see, we did some detailing. I added some light density European suburbia style buildings in here as well, just to kind of make it look you know, a little bit more filled out. I had a little office area here because uh, we I needed some some uh, jobs to help our citizens, you know, go to work. And we got a little bit of commercial area down here as well, but with the kind of like the theater is like the main focal point. Well, I hope you enjoyed the build. There we go, right here. I hope you enjoyed the build. It was fun to build, and it's like I said, a nice little European area that's got like you know it's a low profile, but it's up high on on the ground. So it kind of you know, gives you a little, kind of blends in a little bit with our downtown area. I hope you'll try something like this in your city. Let me know how it goes. Thank you very much for watching. And of course, I'm on Twitch at News Build Cities. Uh, leave a comment if you, you liked it. Subscribe or send me a like. And as always, happy building.